I don't turn my back on him. Unfortunately, I just do not know if he did or he didn't. Brother Polite, <laughs> nigga, you just don't fucking get it. You just don't get it. <laughs> now, here it is. You are currently on trial. <laughs> you pretty much on trial. Fighting for your fucking life. <laughs> and you out catching new charges in a playground. Passing out candy. <laughs> now, why the fuck would you go anywhere near a school? <laughs> Motherfucker, that's first of all. Why would you be anywhere near a school? You was told not to, to be within a thousand feet from schools, candy stores, motherfucking toy stores. You just don't fucking get it. You don't give a fuck. <laughs> You pull up in a nice car. You got the little chocolate bitch you be you be with. I don't know if that's your wife or not. I think you bought her a piano, you know. And you pull up with candy talking about you passing that shit out for Halloween. You just trying to be a good Samaritan. Brother fucking polite. I feel sorry for you, man. You know, in a way, I I, I, I shouldn't feel sorry for you. But I feel sorry for you for the simple fact that something mentally wrong with you <laughs> to be on Instagram, you know what I mean? Showing off, acting like you ain't bothered by none of these motherfucking alleged offenses. Then you're driving up. You got the chocolate bitch. I think you had another, you had a white bitch in the car. The chocolate bitch jump out the car with a handful of candy in the playground, passing that motherfucking shit out. You should be out looking for an alibi. <laughs> ain't that what they fucking told you that you need an alibi? You can't try to say that Young Pharaoh's your alibi, motherfucker, because Young Pharaoh was out of space at that time. Young Pharaoh, I think he was in Jupiter at the time of these alleged offenses. So you can't say that Young Pharaoh was your fucking alibi, nigga. That's what you need to be focused on. But instead, instead, you are out catching new fucking cases, nigga. I don't give a fuck what kind of language you speak or whatever the fuck you think you know, nigga. But I've been to the penitentiary before, nigga. And they don't take kindness to motherfucking child predators, nigga. It's going to be a bad motherfucking bid for you, dude. 23 and fucking 1. And I don't give a fuck who say, oh, why is he making a joke out of this shit? Nigga, you can check my record, nigga. You won't see none of that type shit on my fucking shit. And I've been to prison, nigga. I ain't proud of it, but I'm not ashamed of that shit either, nigga. So I know what's on the other side. These other niggas be talking, but they don't know. So I see if you ain't been there, it's going to be terrible for that motherfucker. And we ain't never take kindness to fucking child predators in prison. We ain't never take our foot off those niggas necks. Or stop taking their motherfucking snacks and their commissary and shit. So I'm still going to keep my foot on this nigga's black ass fucking neck. You understand me? But brother polite, I'm going to say a prayer for you. Even though I don't think that motherfucking shit is going to help. <laughs> I'm going to pray with, for you, man. Because you really need some fucking help.